a drawbridge. There's a sign that says we shouldn't do this. And there's a pedestrian lapping us. <laughs> now it's dumping rain. We are in Sarasota. Welcome to Turtle Beach. It's a random band of mariachis. I picked it that way, by the picture. I actually got pineapple and broccoli on my pizza. Try not to be too disgusted. <laughs> Where do we go from? Where do we go from here? We're hanging out in Brereton for a few days and then checking out the area around Sarasota. And my hand seems to be missing something. So this little dream we picked up in Thailand, it's a dual voltage water kettle that we've now been carrying around for I think three years and it still works like a charm. We've got our little discount French press. Oh, and for this road trip, we ordered a cheap little rice cooker. The only problem with this kettle is since it's dual voltage when it's on 110 here in the States, it heats really slow, but it still works. Filter is very important because Katie does not like grounds in her coffee. Yay! Coffee that doesn't taste like this. It's hot, 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 hot. Traffic's definitely not a selling point around here. But hey, how often do you get to get, you know, stuck on a drawbridge in traffic? Stop and go. Now we're on the drawbridge. I don't see any any ships, so I think we're okay. To be fair, there's a sign that says we shouldn't do this, but everybody else is doing it and we've just kind of forced along, so we'll just cross our fingers and hope. Kate's very excited by that boot. We've been on this bridge way too long if I'm excited about a boot. All right, we're moving now. Things are gonna be better. I can feel it happening. We're almost catching up to a girl that's walking that passed us like 20 minutes ago. So. <laughs> that bridge over there has like light traffic in both directions. Oh, and there's a pedestrian lapping us. We should have gone Kate's way and gone to that bridge over there. Look at that, we're turning right. Yay! Holy crap, we're actually moving. You're not taking this way back. Whoa! -ho. It's important to get to know a place and know why you don't want to deal with their traffic. While we're in Manatee Public Beach, and while we were waiting in that long line of traffic, the uh, weather went to hell. The weather turned to crap, but it really turned to crap. <laughs> now it's dumping rain. We got a little reprieve. Head into the car to warm up. <laughs> Out we go. Manatee Beach is cool. There's free public parking, which is a nice plus. Other than that, eh. Yesterday, after the drenching we received, <laughs> we went home, snuggled up in bed, and watched a couple movies. Today we are in Sarasota and we're exploring this beautiful little town. Wish we would have had this weather yesterday for the beach. Maybe we'll go to the beach today too. <laughs> well, probably. Mr. 
sister cities of Sarasota, Merida, Yucatan. Been there, loved it. It's too windy to talk. you siesta beach the good news is they have free parking bad news it was packed so here we are at turtle beach Ooh. what you do oh we already learned that Well, we found the Blaze Pizza along our route, but they were closed. So next best thing, we're heading to Hooters. <laughs> it's wings time. <laughs> Kate actually chose it. I did. I chose it. I love wings. <laughs> Just a random man of mariachis. How cool. like Bradenton and Sarasota. Sarasota had a very nice vibe and community atmosphere. Now we're in Fort Myers at Six Mile Cypress Slough Preserve. It just sounded really pretty, a boardwalk over water. I picked it that way, by the picture. That's as much as I know about it. Parking's a dollar an hour or five dollars for the entire day. How long do you think this is gonna take us? Well, only two hours because that's as much as we paid for. <laughs> No jogging. Ah, don't have to worry about that. I hate exercise. <laughs> we are here. We're gonna go there. This is one of the premier bird watching sites in the United States. So we're talking quiet. It was well worth the two dollars. Definitely. So we can get drunk in the street, yeah. Spinning around all these lampposts like we're in a movie, but that's right, Jay. Cause <laughs> you and me feels like I know we would. So the six miles Cypress Slough was a great walk. It's all boardwalk the whole way. Really pretty. One way, so. Tons of animals and out, out there. There's an interpretive trail. 
It took us about 45 minutes. The only downside is that we're midweek and off season and there's, it's still, there's a lot of people and the boardwalks are really narrow. So it's quite easy to get stuck behind uh, really slow people. So if you're going out for a, for a nice exercise walk, this is probably not the place, but if you want to <laughs> see some, uh, some pretty swamp and birds and stuff, this is it. Yeah. Can't beat the price. No. What's next on our agenda? Um, oh, we're going to go see if Blaze Pizza is open. I like that agenda. <laughs> we went to the first Blaze Pizza. It was closed. So we tried another city and it was open. I actually got pineapple and broccoli on my pizza. Try not to be too disgusted. <laughs> Mm. Crunchy, pineapple sweet, this is a good pizza. I got spicy sauce, ghost pepper meatballs, pepperoni, ham, jalapenos, pineapple. If you haven't tried Blaze Pizza, you should find one and go to it because they're, they're really good. My crust is cauliflower, they also have like a keto crust and all sorts of other different ones. Oh yeah, and two pizzas with any toppings you want on them, special crust, it was $23. That's not bad. That's cheaper than tacos. Okay, you're gonna have to try. Oh, yeah. You have to try broccoli. No, on your pizza. Oh, that has to be on my pizza. It has to be on your pizza. It has to be on your pizza. Why would I ask you to eat a topping? <laughs> you're a special girl, okay? I am special. Out we go. Keep drinking this coffee. <laughs> Leave the thumbs up and subscribe. Oh, no, that was good. That was good. That was good. <laughs>